Hey everyone, this is Anton from PocketNow.com, Michael behind the camera. We are in Barcelona for the 2013 MWC, Samsung showing off the Galaxy Note 8.0. We're taking a look at it right now. So this is the Galaxy Note 8.0 hardware here. We're taking a look at this 8-inch device. We'll just take it for a quick hardware tour. Uh, very, very similar to the Note 2 and the Galaxy S3. Actually, from the back, if you use your imagination a little bit, it looks almost like somebody blew up a render of the Galaxy S3, complete with the, uh, the raised camera hump here. But this is a 5-megapixel camera around the back. This battery cover is not removable, uh, but it does cover up a 4,600 milliamp hour battery underneath. You can see the S Pen hidden away down under here. It is uh, kind of an intermediate size S Pen between the, uh, the one on the Note 10.1 and the Note uh, 2, I believe. On the right hand side, power standby, volume keys, and an IR blaster, which we'll talk about in a second. Come around on top, just the headphone jack. Micro SD expands the onboard memory, which can be either 16 or 32 gigs. That's expandable via micro SD. There's your SIM card slot. This is the pre production international version. And down below, micro USB port. It looks like dual speakers flanking those and up front here of course we have the uh, the front facing camera sensors and this 8 inch panel now for, as far as the display goes this is a 1280 by 800 panel uh, kicking out a pixel density of 189 ppi it is a tft panel and uh, just before I get too far away from the hardware specs on the device, this is a um, this is 338 grams. And we'll talk about this in relation to other tablets on another video, but it feels neither substantial nor flimsy in the hand. It is in that perfect sweet spot that the uh, the Note 2 occupies, and Samsung seems to have continued their look and feel push with this. I mean, it's, you can see the hyperglaze coating picking up my fingerprints uh, very, very readily here. You're definitely going to want to get a case if you're considering this device um, and as well on the front as well. But it's, like I say, uh, the Samsung was talking about carrying it as though it were a journal or as though it were a, a small notepad. And it does feel very much like that. And on this global version here, you can see the earpiece up top. This can be used as a phone. It has a dialer built in. I believe we were running just a second ago. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> and you can indeed hold it right up to your head if you want to. Now that feature is gonna be removed from the US variant, we're told. Um, obviously, Samsung could change their mind on that, but uh, we'll talk more about that in a second. But let's talk about hardware. This, uh, excuse me, let's talk about software. This is uh, Android 4.1.2 running a standard overlay of TouchWiz. This is gonna be familiar to anyone who has operated a Samsung device, a modern Samsung device, as you can see here. Not much has changed. Let's see if we can get some of the glare off the screen there. But uh, there is some custom software here, most particularly for the uh, to take advantage of the IR Blaster. The S Remote is going to allow you to control your not just Samsung TV, but your um, your regular TV, your DVR, your Blu-ray player right from the device, which we think is pretty cool. So this is an awesome Note, and this is the Android version, which is debuting on the Note and the Galaxy Note 8.0. Uh, this was formerly on another platform, a competing platform, but uh, you know, Samsung made mention of the fact that, yeah, they've always bundled S Note in, right? So you can always come into the home screen, you, can, you, you double tap, and you've got your pop-up S Note, and you can do all the kind of fun things that S Note gives you. But uh, Awesome Note brings a whole lot more features. It brings a lot more granular control. I'm just going to ditch that. And as you can see, we haven't taken a big tour of this, but you can see just on the home screen view here the level of, uh, of control that you have with this app and the, the level of detail you can drill down into. And Samsung, there it is with the, the diary functionality. They love, love, love building in the ability to use your device, whatever size, uh, as a diary. So it's good to see that that's here. Obviously, we're going to take a look a little, uh, more about this device. We'll just hop into the browser here, but there's not a whole lot new. You see, we've air view functions just the same as it does on any other device with the S Note. And then, of course, we can do multi view in here. If we're making a phone call, we can bring the dialer up here, function with that while we're browsing. Um, you know, that's going to be very familiar to anyone who's used a Note device before. Um, and we'll have more in depth assertions once we spend some more time. But this is just a quick look the Galaxy Note 8.0 from Samsung announced here at MWC in Barcelona. I'm Michael Fisher, it's Pocket Now. Stay tuned for a lot more.